In human challenge trials, volunteers are deliberately infected with the disease to test whether a vaccine provides enough protection. This is different to standard late-stage vaccine trials, where you have to wait for people to be exposed to an illness naturally. Challenge trials involve young, healthy adults who are among the least likely to be affected. Some are given the vaccine, some are not. Individuals are then exposed to the disease. If you're testing a very infectious disease, such as COVID-19, you then have to keep them away from other people to prevent further transmission. Scientists then monitor their progress over time to work out the extent of protection offered by the vaccine. Some say that deliberately infecting healthy people is unethical, given there's no definitive cure for COVID-19. Even in low-risk groups, there is a small chance people could become very ill. Some could even die. Others question how much can be learned if you're only testing the vaccine on younger, healthier people rather than the at-risk population who would benefit most from a vaccine. But many people argue that these trials could help speed up the development of a coronavirus vaccine. If shown to be protective sooner, the vaccine could be rolled out more quickly, and that would save lives.